Now at 10, children living in feces and trash with rats and insects. Tonight, parents of the four kids are now behind bars. We want to warn you, these images may be just difficult to see. The Bear County Sheriff's Office revealing what they're calling horrific conditions with these photos. They say the smell was so foul, they thought they were going to uncover a decomposing body. Ken's Five reporter Henry Ramos is live tonight at the Sheriff's Office. Henry, you just learned brand new information. Yeah, Sharon, more than an hour ago, I got the names of the parents. We're talking about 37 year old Danielle Kinsey and 33 year old Paul Kinsey, the duo charged with four counts of endangering a child. Uh, the sheriff telling me that Paul is from Europe and is the father of two of the children. As for Danielle, she's the mother of all of them. These pictures tell the story. The Bear County Sheriff's Office says these are from an apartment where four children lived. Look at this photo of the bathroom with trash all over. Insects appearing to be around the bathtub and toilet. It's actually pretty heartbreaking. The scene of the crime at this northeast side apartment located at Montgomery and New World Drive. A neighbor called in BCSO for a foul smell. When we smell that very distinctive smell, we're fully expecting to find a dead body. No body found. Instead, this is what investigators discovered. Mountains of trash, insects, animal and human feces. The sheriff says rats even crawling on the feet of deputies. We don't have any indication that anyone was lit, was physically dead inside the apartment. I mean, clearly they're going to be searching it. But at this point, there's just there's there's just indication that these kids were being exposed to just squalor. The youngest child only two years old, the oldest 13. The sheriff says despite the conditions, they were OK. We couldn't figure out how it is that kids have been living in these conditions for any amount of time at all. The kids, thankfully, were relatively healthy. Relatively healthy, saying the sheriff and earlier he says they were looking for a relative so that these children could stay with late tonight. BCSO saying that they are with CPS. The sheriff saying that these parents, they should have known better, even adding that Danielle works at a hospital. We're live from BCSO tonight. Henry Ramos, Ken's five. Sharon.